everyone and welcome back to our COVID-19 blog series. Today I want to talk about a recent experience I had working with an opinions editor to get an op-ed from one of our clients submitted and placed. I was working with the editor and he was interested in the piece so I asked him when it might run. He let me know that he'd seen an influx of submissions recently and he really had a backlog of submissions he had to get through. He explained that as people are working remotely and are spending more time social distancing at home, they really have the time and are taking the time to write letters to the editor, write op-eds, and send them into their local papers. This was some really helpful insight and provided perspective and understanding into, okay, we might be up against a greater quantity of submissions than we're used to that are all fighting for the same column space. There are a few points I took away from this that I wanted to share. First is just like any media pitch or anything you would send to a reporter, keep your piece timely. Work with your clients to make sure that their pieces are relevant and have some sense of timeliness to them. Our client's piece was of course related to their industry but was tied into the current coronavirus situation and was also something that would be of interest to the newspaper's readers. This is, of course, something we want to do with any pitch or any piece we send out. But now more than ever, as we fight through a lot of other submissions and are up against a lot more pieces that are looking to get placed, we need to take the time and really make sure that our clients' pieces are as strong as they can be to help get them published. I also learned, second, to give myself some more lead time when it comes to pitching pieces. Because this particular editor explained that he had a backlog of submissions, I realized that the publication time would be pushed back a little bit, maybe later than I was used to when submitting pieces. So making sure to take this into account and if you're looking to have a piece placed on a certain week or certain day because it's a national recognition or something that really ties into your piece, just giving more time to send that in, polish that piece perfectly, work with your client to make sure it's ready to go and get that out earlier rather than later. Finally, as always, we want to be patient with our contacts in the media and figure out how we can best serve them. Give them pieces that their readers are going to care about. Give them those well-written pieces that they're not going to have to do much editing to, if any editing at all, and have that ready for them and understand that they are working in such a unique world just like we are and just figuring out how we can best serve them in that sense. Thanks so much for watching today's vlog and we'll see you guys next time.